Hello guys, thank you for joining me today for this beautiful Twin Flame reading. I hope you're well and you're staying focused, believing and trusting what you already know. Welcome to all the new subscribers, thank you so much for joining me on my journey, supporting me on my journey and supporting my channel, I'm so very grateful. And thank you to all of you for all the beautiful comments, sharing with me your news and how you've been feeling, if my readings resonate and sharing your love with me and encouragement. It blows me away every day when I read the comments. So thank you so much for taking the time out of the day to leave me a beautiful comment. And the whole purpose of this channel is for me to be connected to people all over the world who are in the same or similar situation to me so we can help each other, so we can share the love because as you know this journey is very painful at times and challenging because we're making our way back to who we truly are, our true self, back home and we're allowing the ego to fall away. So thank you so much for being part of my dream and making my dream come true. So today I'm going to be using the Archangel Animal Oracle deck. I'm going to start with the Divine Masculines to see how they're feeling today, what energy they're in and what they're experiencing. And I will be getting some communication as well from the Divine Masculine 101, from beautiful Liz Harrison, from Guided by Angels. And then I will be getting a card for you as well, Divine Feminines, from the Archangel Animal deck to see what you need to know today to help you stay focused, to believe and trust in what you already know. So I'm going to start shuffling. I do use the labels Divine Feminine, Divine Masculine. Please don't be offended. Just put it into your situation, how it resonates with you. I do realise it's just energy. And if any of you guys would like a private reading for a clearer message, for more guidance for your beautiful, unique Twin Flame journey, just email me. It's in the description box down below and I can book you in. The November reading is now up. So go and check that out guys, it was very powerful and the November extended reading is available to purchase now. So if you'd like to purchase it, the email for that is in the description box down below too and it's only $2.22. And the extended for November will blow your mind too guys. <laughs> and what is it today we need to know about the Divine Masculines, what's going on with the Divine Masculines today? What energy are they in, how are they feeling? energy they in what they're experiencing today nice clear message please turtle be joyful and trusting and guinea pig do your part to illuminate the universe and at the bottom of the deck is goat act from your innate wisdom so the Divine Masculines are trusting today, trusting themselves, knowing, knowing the importance of trusting themselves, trusting that light and love that they have within them, underneath this shell, <laughs> deep within them. And when they are trusting themselves and experiencing this trust, it makes the Divine Masculines feel so joyful about life. And the whole outlook just changes. And it's so clear and it's so pure. As you can see this beautiful water the turtle's in. Everything looks so bright and beautiful. Also when they're trusting themselves, this light that they have within shines so bright and so powerful. It radiates out into the universe. Because they're feeling so much more confident about themselves, who they are, and what they are, their uniqueness. By trusting themselves, by trusting in God, is, is loving themselves too, which is an amazing feeling, which creates so much joy, this joyfulness. And that is what they want to experience, and they know that they can experience this just by trusting. So they're coming out of their shell. <laughs> because of trust, they realise that they don't have to have this shell. They don't have to have this protection around their heart when they trust themselves and when they trust in God, the universe. And then we come to guinea pig. Do your part to illuminate the universe. 
So when the divine masculines are being themselves, trusting themselves, the power within them, the light within them, the love within them does illuminate the universe. It heals the planet, it heals the world. By them just being their authentic self, their true self. And this is what the divine masculines want. They want to be able to have such an impact on the world. And their understanding it is so simple and all it boils down to them just being themselves, being honest with themselves and giving to themselves, giving love to themselves. And understanding that that's so powerful because when you give love to yourself, it does radiate out into the universe and it's felt, it has such an impact. It's felt and it's so healing. And some of your divine masculines may have deep passion within themselves that they do want to heal the world, they do want to heal the planet. It's something that's really important to them. And they're learning that it's just simple. It's just about them being themselves, being honest, being love. The power of love conquers all. So the energy today for the divine masculine is, you know, they are learning the importance of trusting themselves. They are trusting themselves. They're learning about themselves and learning how important them trusting themselves and giving love to themselves. And the feeling that they get when they do give to this love to themselves and they trust themselves, you know, that light just is so bright, <laughs> so powerful. And it's about them understand, understanding their significance, how important that this love for themselves is. Because when you give love to yourself, you can love so, you can give and love so much more <laughs> when you actually give to yourself first. And they're open. They're opening up more and more to receive so much guidance. Because it is important to them that they have positive impact on the world. They want to light the world up. They want to help to they want to do their part, like it says in the car, to illuminate the universe. But they're understanding that it comes from within first to be able to illuminate the universe. So beautiful, isn't it guys? The divine masculine is very good energy. So as I said, I'm going to be using the Divine Masculine 101 from beautiful Liz Harrison to see what the Divine Masculines would love to communicate, what words they'd love to share with you today. What would they love to express today? What communication? What do they want you to know? Nice clear message, please. You are my world. <laughs> I mentioned world quite a few times during this reading as well. <laughs> Don't pay attention to my moods. <laughs> and oh my goodness, all falling guys. You turn me on so much. And at the bottom of the deck is I get so mad at myself about how I treat you. Yeah. So they're feeling, you know, they do get really mad with themselves, guys. They do beat themselves up about the way they treat you. And that's what they're saying to you. Don't pay attention to my moods. Don't pay attention to the way I behave sometimes. And as you know, guys, when you're on this journey, you just feel so many different things. One minute you can be fine and you're like jumping about with joy <laughs> and the next minute you could be experiencing really dark energies and you're just like feeling really down and you can come across as if you're really moody. So the message really for you from your divine masculine today is don't take it personally. Mm. And they are very sorry and they do get mad with themselves 
they do get cross with themselves the way they behave sometimes and they are learning about that while they're in this preparation why you're not with the physical person they're learning about themselves and to find that balance with their higher self and their ego they're still learning and the same for you you're learning that as well you're learning about yourself and how certain things make you feel and to, to have that balance and awareness and consciousness of what's going on when you're experiencing high vibrational energy and low vibrational energy but they the, but they really want you to know today you are my world you are their world you light their world up just by being you and they want you to know this that you are my world and you motivate them you give them that drive to do this journey to have this relationship with themselves to go deep within to find that light that love within them to make peace with themselves to experience inner peace you are their world and they're so very grateful for you so don't pay attention to my moods so whatever you're experiencing in the 3d right now from your divine masculine you know you could be experiencing silence or conflict and confusion and where they're being very cold towards you and you're not sure what's going on they're coming across quite moody whatever's going on see beyond that and they don't mean it and don't take it personal because you are their world <laughs> they're just working through things and removing things that no longer serve them so they have to feel things they do experience fear they're having to experience fear so they can remove it which does create you to be a bit moody <laughs> as you know guys yourself but they you, you turn them on so much they're really feeling turned on you turn them on so much everything about you just turns them on so they're really so they're experiencing this sacred love making energy this sexual energy they're desiring and longing to be with you and they're really allowing themselves to feel you they can feel you they can feel your love and you could be experiencing the same thing where you're feeling your divine masculine you're experiencing this you know this sacred love making energy and if you was feeling down about yourself today you wasn't feeling very attractive or <laughs> very beautiful you know this message is for you because you turn your divine masculine on so much everything just by being you so don't change because they love you just the way you are and it turns them on so much so now i'm going to be getting a card from the archangels for you divine feminines to see what you need to know to help you stay focused to believe and trust in what you already know your guidance is it that you need to know today which is the guidance for the divine feminines to help them stay focused to believe and trust in what they already know sheep Act with fortitude and cooperation, Archangel Gabriel and Hope. And at the bottom of the deck is that. See through illusions into truth. Yeah, so as I said, see through the illusions, whatever's going on, whatever you're experiencing from your divine masculine right now in the 3D, see beyond that. Because you are their world and they turn you turn them on so much. <laughs> I love you so much. So this beautiful card, as you can see, there's two sheep. <laughs> and we have a beautiful blue rose, especially for my friend Anna. <laughs> and we can see, this is beautiful, guys, the way they're cuddling up to each other. So this is about you acting with confidence, with power, from love. And not allowing yourself to do this all by yourself. Cooperate with others, like-minded people. 
part of your soul family, your soul tribe, open up to your soul family and cooperate with God, with the universe. And you will regain so much power by handing your burdens, the weight on your shoulders, over to the universe, to God, to help you. You don't have to do this all by yourself. So don't give up hope. And you cooperate with God, the universe, and with others, your soul family, by trusting. <laughs> It all comes down to trusting, trusting your intuition, trusting yourself, trusting this love that you feel so deep within, trusting this journey, this beautiful sacred journey that you're on. That's how you can cooperate, by trusting. And Archangel Gabriel is about communication. So don't give up hope. We'll allow Archangel Gabriel to bring communication to you, if that's what you're asking for, if that's what you're hoping to receive. And in my small video this morning, it was miracles for Twin Flames, so miracles are happening all the time. It's whether we're aware or conscious of them happening. <laughs> And there's so many coming to you. So act with fortitude, act with confidence, which is love. And cooperate with the universe, with God, which is trust. <laughs> Lean on God, the universe. And trust. You don't have to do this all alone. So I really do hope that you've enjoyed this beautiful twin flame reading, beautiful energy for the Divine Masculine and beautiful guidance for you, Divine Feminine as well. Communication as well is just amazing. So, so I really do hope this has helped somebody today. So as I said at the beginning of the reading, guys, if any of you would like a private reading for a clearer message for your beautiful, unique twin flame journey and you'd like some more guidance at the moment for a clearer message, just email me. It's in the description box down below. And if you are new, don't forget to subscribe, like and share because it really does help my channel grow. And I'm sending you so much love, my support, my strength and light. And I love you all so very much. See ya. Oh, what's your soul saying? Oh.